boots and nearly five boards a game. But it all can't lie on the veteran big man's shoulders. It's be important his teammates step up to the challenge here today. Here's the starting five for Qatar. Mohamed, Fauda, Mohamed, Khalid and Abdel Halim. That's and uh, probably most importantly, the highlight videos as well. So make sure you go and download the official FIBA World Cup app today. And uh, if you are enjoying some of those highlight videos, make sure you share them on social media. Let's get uh, these World Cup qualifiers trending globally. And if you do, Karen averaging 7.2 points per game. He's featured in every single one of Australia's qualifiers. Fowler from the corner, and he returns the favour with the three himself. Mohamed pulls the trigger on the three himself and nails it. Big shot. Event for Australia that's paying dividends at the moment. They're making sure they take their time. They know in the 24 seconds that they're going to get a good shot opportunity. There's no pressure on rushing. Mohamed to Mohamed. Oh, and he hits the three as well. The big man steps out from range. First two of the game for him. Mohamed now to Mohamed. He uh, steps back for the three and hits the three. And Qatar have found some form from the perimeter. And Australia's lead down to four. Not what the pre-game expectations were. Kadi for three. Control after a late spurt in that, fin in that final few seconds of the quarter. They lead by 12 after 10 minutes. And they're on course for another big win. And that said, Qatar has shown they can score. And my goodness me, they can score in a hurry as well. Moves like that from uh, Mohamed. Mohamed, show. It's, uh, Mohamed now. Turns the corner, little hesitation, drives inside, tries to draw some contact with Khan and can't quite get the score either, but the ball will be batted back to Khalid. In the hands of Mohamed, who's probably been one of the bigger impact players for Qatar so far, and he's going to make another impact now. And one. Mod Maham, Mo, Mohamed with the uh, two under the basket and draws the foul. Wonderful pass from Khalid. Drew both Johnson and Muller across. Absolutely critical for Qatar. When Mohamed's on the floor, things go their way. But here's Mohamed. Mohamed frustrated that he doesn't receive the ball when he's secured a low position. Australia sitting on a 2 3 zone now. Mohamed will shoot the three and hit the three. As a coach, it's not what you want to see. The ball stays in the hands of the same player pretty much for your whole shot clock. But he got himself out of jail with that one. And the three from the wing. So Qatar will actually get another opportunity to hopefully replicate what they've seen there with Mohamed draining a three. Four seconds left on the game clock for the half. Mohamed pulls up. Comes up short, and he certainly does like having the ball in his hands, Mohamed Mohamed. But at the half-time break here, at in Melbourne, Australia lead this one 50 to 34 over Qatar. Mohamed, he's got 11 points, two rebounds, assists, and a steal to his name. And uh, just behind him is Mohamed Mohamed with nine points, all of them coming from the perimeter. 